Nancy Drew, The Silent Spy. Dare to play. It's locked. A little bit. A little bit. Okay. Is that better? <laughs> it was a little loud at the beginning. I apologize. Okay. Um, I think my category changed today. Hi guys! Well, come on in! We're just starting. A new Nancy Drew game. Mmm, it's called The Silence. Well, it's not new, sorry. New Nancy Drew game for us on this channel. But we're gonna play new new one for us called The Silent Spy, and it's like about her mom or something like that. So, how exciting. Thanks for the follows. Thanks for the likes, guys. Appreciate it. Alright, let's begin. Everything good? Is it not too loud? Have you heard of Nancy Drew Via? Okay, new game. Ooh my gosh, ooh the music. We're gonna have to do spy things, guys. Cutting some wires. Whoa, 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 we're at her. Whoa, her desk is different. We're in her backyard looks different. Whoa, it looks different. Can I fix this? Oh. Security service, M15 Cathedral. Or MI, I think. Nancy Drew, our agency has been monitoring your progress for some time now. We are quite impressed with your accomplishments. I'll get to the point. Certain events have forced our organization to reopen a case that has gone unsolved for the last eight years. Although impressive, your fieldwork experience is only part of the reason we're requesting your help. Simply put, Miss Drew, we're asking for your help, not because of what you can do, but because of who you are. Eight years ago, Kate Drew died in a single automobile crash in the outskirts of Glasgow. This official version of your mother's death is, as you may have suspected, not the entire story. Her death was not an accident. We have strong evidence that Kate was killed by the very group she was investigating. Oh my god! That's how we find out that her mom was murdered? We need your help. We've included a plane ticket and have a room ready for you at the Glaucus, Glaucus Lodge. You will be briefed upon arrival. There is no time to spare. The future of Glasgow. Am I saying Glasgow right, by the way? It's Scotland! May rest in your hands. A Office of International Affairs. Wow. <gasps> Who is that? Is that her mom? <gasps> is that her mom? Oh my god, no way. That's her mom! <gasps> that's Nancy's mom! Whoa, that's trippy! Mom? She's having a moment. <gasps> Flashback. Whoa. Whoa, we're going through her house again. It's been a while since we've seen her house. Whoa. Flashback. Oh, her mom's playing the piano. I know, Nancy's, Nancy's from a rich household. Drew Residence, Kate speaking. You know this line isn't secure. Moira, stop. I'll call you. Nancy, do you have a cold? <laughs> mm? Oh no, is there echo? Oh shoot. I'll fix it in one second. <laughs> it's Nancy's real voice. It is. Also, sorry, one second. Let me fix. Let me fix the audio real quick. Um, <laughs> so funny. All right, let me know if that fixes it via, uh, oh, oh my god, the game crashed. Oh no, I'm sorry, chat. Oh no, why did it crash? Oh, 
gosh darn it. It crashed. Sorry. Okay, we're gonna have to see the flash. <laughs> we're gonna have to see the flash back again. <laughs> Sorry. <Huh? laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Darn it, I guess it, like, I guess it crashes when you alt-tab it. Um, <laughs> can I skip it? It's Nancy. Listen carefully, it's Nan. It's actually Nancy's voice, but she just made it sound a little bit deeper. <laughs> Should we get a new voice actor for Nancy's mom? Nah, just put her down and watch. <laughs> okay. Drew Residence, Kate speaking. You know this line isn't secure. Moira, stop. I'll call you. Moira, stop. I'll call you. Like her mom. I fixed the echo? Okay, good. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, ooh, that transition. This is where mom was in the picture. Okay, now what? Oh! Hey, my suitcase! <gasps> Somebody stole a suitcase! I'm on it. Oh. That guy's a thief! I really, Action really packed. thought I was going to get that guy. Sorry. Oh. <sighs> Thanks for trying. I'm Alec. Nancy. That's a nice offer, but why With would you accent. want to do that? It doesn't look like you work here. I'm in the business of finding people who don't want to be found. Well, I won't turn down help. So, you're a private eye? I'm more of a skip well. tracer. For the likes, guys. When someone goes off the grid, I get a call and a track them down. Trace. They skip, I trace. I had some very important things that belonged to my mom in that suitcase. I really need them back. Go check into your hotel. I will find your suitcase. What a nice guy. 727. It's locked. Oh, I have my key. Nice. All right. Oh wait, I think the settings didn't. It's save. locked. Let's it's locked. Turn this down just a little bit more. Nancy, glad you made it. I'm your cathedral contact, Ewan. There's a case Ew. file in your room. Read it. Memorize it. Is this a That's different your guy? That's playbook. It'll keep you alive. Sounds like I've got a bit like of housekeeping to do. Get settled. We'll call you when I'm ready. Okay. Sounds like the guy who teaches Harry Potter about Quidditch. It <laughs> doesn't. Yeah, Scottish accent. That suitcase has all my pantaloons. <laughs> this is a nice. This is nice. Wow. Okay, fresh flowers. Ooh, ooh, the view. Don't fall, Nancy. Can I like? Is there anything to click on? We're probably gonna have to watch people down here or something. Nope, go back. Alright, ooh, look at her bed, a canopy bed. Can I sleep on it? Ooh, okay, we got... Ooh, outlets. Hmm, 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 hmm. I don't know what we're doing. Hmm, Why am hmm. I humming? Okay, where's this case file? Oh, it's in the safe. Right. Or is it in the safe? Darn it. <laughs> is there anything else in here? Well, it must be in an obvious location. I just skipped over it. Ooh, look at these drawings. Wait. Here we go. Wait, can I not? I can't click it? Ooh, the AC went on. Oh, that's nice. Wait, where is the case file? What? Find the... I'm, f I'm trying to find it. Oh, here we go. Ah, oh, here we go. Ooh, money. Money! Top secret. Eyes only. Um... Miss Drew, I must welcome you to Scotland with very unfortunate news. You have been led here under false pretenses. You are not here as a guest of the cathedral. You are not asked here to investigate the death of your mother by MI5. MI you have been lied to. <gasps> Kate Drew, your mother was a cathedral operative eight years ago. 
a small cell associated with a terrorist organization known as the Revenant attempted to attack Glasgow. Kate was instrumental in stopping the attack, now known as the Colony Operation. We believe the organization your mother took offline has returned to full strength and is now planning to mount the attack once more. We believe you have been brought here by Revenant for reasons we do not yet fully understand. If this is overwhelming, do not worry. We will give you access to information as needed. We are in the process of briefing your contact on the situation. He will bring you in soon. Your first priority is to locate and make contact with a local reporter named Moira Chisholm. She was considered a person of interest in the first attempted attack on Scotland, but was never directly connected. She has since refused to cooperate with this organization. We will be keeping a close watch on you at all times, but this does not mean that you will be protected. Please note this difference. Move forward cautiously and bring no and trust no one. Anyone who approaches you should be considered a suspect. Attached, you will find a basic brief to get you somewhat caught up on what you need to know. Wow! So that was a lie to get us here. And then now these, well, what are these people are lying? All right, the brief. Cathedral, an organization dedicated to the safety of Glasgow and surrounding areas. This organization acts as an intelligence outpost and reports to MI5. It is equivalent to what would be a local branch of the FBI in the U.S. Okay, thanks guys. Thanks James. Appreciate it. <laughs> it's so intense. Competing spy organizations. Yeah. <laughs> Hi Radio. Happy Sunday. Hope you guys are having a good weekend. Oh yeah, we don't have an <laughs> we don't have an adapter. That's probably what it is, James. Quality operation. This the attempted non-lethal biological attack on Glasgow that was thwarted by cathedral operatives eight years ago. The party responsible for the attack was never confirmed, though it is believed Revenant was involved. Current intelligence points to signs that the operation may be restarting. So this is the mission that our mom was on. Colony formula. The colony attack required a very specific and difficult to produce biological wef or biological element. <gasps> it is believed not, but not verified that Kate Drew found a way to destroy all records of the formula and place the individual responsible for creating it into hiding. Ah, mom saved the day. Revenant, very little is known about this group. Revenant is believed to be behind a number of terrorist events around the globe over the course of the last few decades. Paradoxically, this same group has been linked to as many counter-terrorist activities during that same period. The aim of this organization is not yet known. Wow. Is there anything else to pick up? So Check. we need to find Moira, and we heard Moira's name be spoken to in the flashback we saw. Track down more information about mom's past. Cool. We're gonna need to get access to that safe though. Oh my god, why, okay. The American that scared girl. me. Do I know you? <laughs> what? You do now. I'm Bridget. I'll Bridget. be outside. There's something very important I need to tell you. Oh, okay. All right, Bridget. Why did that scare me, darn it? <gasps> I am dressed like Bridget. <gasps> What's that? What was that? Is that more money? Ho oh, ho, money. Is this the elevator? Okay. Oh, okay. Awesome. I just want to check to see like what is around us. Okay, that's that's the elevator. What's over here? That's Nancy's room. Oh, it looks like we can't go that way. Okay. We'll just go in the elevator. Um, so we're on the seventh floor. What is I pH? guess I only have access to my floor and the main floor. Oh, okay. So. Oh, G? G. There she is. You had something <laughs> important to tell me? <laughs> just that Same I love Americans. Everything. Some people say you're ignorant, entitled slobs, but not me. I don't know if that was important. Of course it Cosplaying, is! You've got Nancy the best cities, the best bands, Hollywood! 
Your star may be fading, but you're still the cool kids at the global lunch table. Teach me your ways. I'm sorry, but I'm sort of in the middle of something pretty important. First, you get a giant a little cup overbooked. that's as big as your they head. They say that now, but coffee. I can tell we're going to be friends or enemies. Either way, get used to this face right here. Why did she say we're gonna be enemies? Suspicious. <laughs> Excuse you, we're fat, ignorant, entitled slobs. <laughs> How can you tell I'm American? How could you tell I'm an American? I've got a sixth sense about these things. I saw okay. a guy on the train. I just walked up to him and said, You're from Belgium, aren't you? He wasn't, but he should have been. Maybe he just had that dresses? look. Can I follow you around for a whole lot? You seem really nice. The nicest? Ask me, Gran. But I can't really have anyone following me. Please, don't take it personally. No, I, I understand. Please don't be my stalker. <laughs> Please don't stalk me. <laughs> Who says that? Do you work or, or go to school? That? Or That's funny. What do you do? You think I'm from Glasgow. Glasgow. Okay. Go. No. That's how you say it, Ian? It's glorious. I'm actually from Witten. It's Witten? always been a dream of mine to live in the city. And I'm sort of checking it out to see if it's for me. Witten? Where's Witten? No stalker. She's not from Glasgow. Yeah, Wit Witten. Witten. How long are you going to be in Glasgow? Not long. You? I have no why idea. Why did I say Glasgow? How did I, why, how did I get the gal part? That's how you've heard it before? Glasgow? I've no, I haven't, actually. Can you tell me a little bit about Scotland? Just a bit, then. Well, it's old, it's cold, and I like it all the same. I got a book about it. I could get it for you. It's only up in my room. Ooh. All right, let's see if she left something behind. Had we never loved say kindly, had we never loved say blindly, never met or never parted, we had never been broken hearted. Robert Burns. What is say? Had we never loved say kindly? What is say? Trash! Is there any money in the trash can? Ooh! 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 There is money. There's gotta be money nearby. Why else do we have to look? I think I have to have like my my pointer over it to be shiny. I really don't know how that works. Glass gal. That's what I said. Glass gal for us swamp people. <laughs> go. Glass go with an A. <laughs> Wait, that actually makes more sense if it was spelled like that. Kaylee, thanks for the follow. That's my best friend's name. English pronunciation has too many exceptions and too much memorization, to be honest. It really does. Hi, Diaz. Okay, should we buy... Ooh! What is this? We got some stovies, some neeps and tatties, some call cannon, some kippers. Some, oh, Haggis, Rhea's favorite. Oh my god, where's Rhea when we need him? Oh my god, I need to message Rhea. Um, we got some Smokies, some black, a black bun, a Scott pie, a buttery. Oh, I like these names. A tablet, <laughs> a, dun a Dundee cake, a Krena, Krena Chen, Krena Chen. Well, I need to message Rhea. <laughs> a jammy sandwich. I like how this is. This is cute. I need to take a photo of it. Proof.
nice sound effects. Rebecca, thanks for the follow. Taddies or potatoes? What's a neep? What is a neep? Family friendly stream. Yikes. I grew up going to camp outside of Lake Charles. Oh shoot, my phone's about to die. Spanish and Italian symbols, letter combinations, for example, are also are always pronounced the same, no matter the word. Must be nice to have a language that's not as confusing as English. Should we buy one? Let's buy some neeps and tatties. Whoa, we can see it. Wait, what if I say no? Wow, so oh. good. Ooh, so good. What about haggis? Mm. Yum. Yum. Okay, I don't want to spend all of her money here, but... Mm. Ooh, free money. What is this? Help wanted. Oh, hello. Oh. You want to make some money? <gasps> then make some cookies. The cookie order shows up down there. Make it exactly as shown if you want to get paid. The more oh cookies God. you make, the wealthier you get. Cookies! We make cookies? Oops. Cat! We got the top cookie. Oops. Oh. First cookie. Cat, is this how you make it? Oh. I think I did this wrong. Reset. How do I do this? Oh, maybe like this. And then this, and then, ah, oh, 100%. <laughs> All right, uh, then we add some of these blue sprinkles, and uh, is it this? Yes, sir. It's a masterpiece. Oh, wait, the tips go down? Wait, the longer you take? Oh, shoot, okay. Wait, what? Need to work on my cookie spotting skills. Wait, did I do it wrong? Uh. Oh, I see. Don't forget the top cookie. Don't forget the top cookie. I did it wrong. What? Oh, so maybe you're supposed to... Is it this color? How the heck? Oh, the sound effects. I don't like this one. Screw that one. Okay. What? Here. Top cookie. Jam. Star. Blue and red. Sorry. You know what? I can handle not being good at this. Why is she saying I'm doing bad? Am I not making any money? What did I do? I forgot what? I forgot something. Darn it. What game is this? Hi, Rin. It's called um, Nancy Drew the Silent Spy. <laughs> that one looked the same. I know. Okay, so this one's red. And then top layer and then this and then we cut the circle out and then we add sprinkles sir not bad if i do say so myself how did i do that last one okay another one all right so i think we add this stuff and then the sprinkles then the top layer And then this purple jam, and then this star, and then red sprinkles. Got it. Is it on mobile? Um, I don't think any of the Nancy Drew games are on mobile, unfortunately. No, we're playing on PC. Wow, this is fun. I like. I like this though. I like. I like this cat. I like this. Perfect Got it. cookie making. <laughs> Honestly, it's exactly how it felt. <laughs> Here, we'll make one more. One more. So, white, blue. I'm understanding how this works now. It's a masterpiece. Oh my god, 69! I didn't do that on purpose. 
best cookies ever. Save. Nice. <laughs> Alright, is there anything else we can get here? Is that the Scottish flag? Anything else I can click on? I don't think so. Okay. It okay. might be good to read up on the attack. Okay, in Colony Shadow. As July 14th nears, many pause to remember the attack that almost devastated Glasgow nearly a decade ago. The thwarted attack, nicknamed the Colony Operation by the intelligence community, was intended to destabilize the governmental power structure of the greater Glasgow region. The most unique feature of the attempted attack was the custom incubated virus. Oh, <gasps> COVID. A formula built to sicken, but not to kill. The nation's leading epidemiologists have yet to isolate what has been referred to as the final formula. Years later, more questions remain than answers. Authorities continue to investigate leads, hoping one day to answer the three most critical issues at stake. If a second attack is planned, when would it occur? And of course, why? UK Ovid! <laughs> Um, do I need to read this one? Memories of the Future That Almost Was by Jenny Murphy, staff reporter. I was a block and a half away from my flat when the alarms rang out eight years ago. It was the first time I'd heard the civil defense sirens ring in Glasgow. I remember looking at the crowd standing with me on the street. I remember the novelty. I have no idea what to do. A man standing next to me announced with what seemed to be the appropriate amount of cheer. Should I hide under something? Then the siren stopped and the PA cracked on. We ran to our houses, we taped our windows shut, we turned on our TVs to see a parade of reporters, military officials, doctors, terrorism experts. We saw them all share the same stunned blankness we felt at home. I had no idea what to do. Should I hide under something? Then we saw the test pattern take over the broadcast. The strange design we now know to be Revenant's logo. The demand to remain inside and await further instruction. That doesn't happen here. This is Glasgow. The news reporters were back, blinking at us as we blinked at them. Should we hide under something? Following the day of the thwarted attack, that thought, that thought wrapped tightly around my cerebral cortex. I took a day in. I filled my stories from home. Filed my stories from home. We all did. Days went by. I, I sat hutched over my laptop and poured through every report I could find. I was lost in the details. The bombs, chemical propellant systems really pulled offline at the last second. The test pattern so strong it overtook every crooked street. That's intense. All right, let's keep exploring. Train station? I guess that's the only place. To the train. Oh, this is where we were when my stuff was snatched. What is this? Souvenirs? Ooh, what souvenir should we get? What the heck is that? Oh, these are pretty expensive. Here, I'll hold off for now. What the heck is that thing? That thing? We're gonna need that thing. We're gonna need it. I can see us needing that. Unicorn Crossing. Oh, is the unicorn the, the national animal of Scotland? We got a little robot here with some wings, a dragon. Oh, actual robot flying thing. What the heck is that? A reindeer? Cool. Hey, this this looks familiar. What is this from? This looks from another Nancy Drew game. Okay. Let's see. What else can we do? Um, this is where that guy was. Oh, there he is. He's down here. Let's go talk to him. <gasps> is that my stuff? Why did you come alone? Don't you have family, friends? Surely you have a boyfriend. I do. Then why do you travel so lonely? This isn't exactly a vacation. Why is he asking Nancy about if she's single? I need you to find someone for me. She's like I am the please. A reporter named Moira Chisholm. Word is no one knows how to Chisholm. find her. That seems right in your wheelhouse. If I knew what the wheelhouse is, I'd agree. I think it's in a boat. Well, that seems useless. Or it's a baseball thing? Double useless. But yes, I'm on it. Okay. Occupied. Doesn't look occupied. Um, 
What is a gift knock? Better buy a ticket first. Okay. Gift knock. Oh, these are all places. Uh, Bearsden. What is this? Service running I late. I need to have a ticket. How do I get a ticket, Nancy? Oh, tickets. Oh. Ooh, eerie tone. Nancy, you have attracted our attention. Consider this your first test. You will find an envelope in Locker 49. Take it to the Ten Raven Pub in Gifnet. If you do, you will be rewarded. Here's a hint. Harrier checking in. Challenge code for agent CMYK0110. The colony operator has been terminated. Wouldn't you like to know more? Was that mom? Whoa, that sounds like we just got glass code. Covid. <laughs> glass Covid. <laughs> Oh my god, what the heck was that? Okay, so Locker 49. Hold on, I want to see. Oh, we can call Ned directly. Oh, and we we're also able to call her dad. Here, let's call Ned. Let's call her boyfriend. Ned, we got hit on. Not really. Hi, it's Ned. I can't talk right now. Leave a message. Well, so much for having a boyfriend. All right, what about our dad? You've reached the personal line of Carson Drew. Please direct all business matters to the firm switchboard. Well then. Can't check, can't check, did that, did that. Can't check that, can't check that off yet. Can't check that on yet, can't check that on yet. Ooh, money. What is this? Visit Scotland's wild side, Loch Lomond. Relax on the, on the bonnie shores uh, or boat to the islands, Great Britain's largest inland lake. Explore adjoining Trossachs National Park, <gasps> Loch Ness, home of the legendary monster Nessie. Visit the stunning Ur Urquhart Castle. Trek through the surrounding highlands. Stay in luxury. Live like royalty in the hot Glasgow. Brady Armstrong. What? The best place to stay in Scotland. The rooms, the service, the food, it's first class. Isn't that where we're staying? What is this? Scotland Rail, Wyvern's Gate Station. All right, so I need, oh, five maybe? Should we buy a train pass? Five, yes. I'll keep that, thank you. All right, where is the lockers? Are they over, oh, lockers. Wait, what was the number? 49, 46, 46, oops, 49, ah, here we go, save the date, July 14th, it's my best friend's birthday, <laughs> formal invitation to follow, wait, didn't they say that the attack was on July 14th of like the eight years ago, wait, can I, oh, this costs money, <laughs> Ooh, what's behind here? Ooh, what is this? Trash. Trash. Is there any money? Can I take that ladder? Is there any, there's nothing else? What is this? I guess I can't do anything. Maybe I have to like trash compact stuff later. All right, so where did they want me to go? Uh, did they say go to gift knock <laughs> what was it the raven something darn it where's the raven there's lock lamon gift knock beards oh this is all this whole wall is here so let's go to gift knock to gift knock whoa we're on a train Oh, there we go. Letters hmm. only. I'm going to pretend this is for a wedding. <laughs> what else could it be <laughs> for? What are these doing here? Oh, nice. A weapon. I will use those. Oh, God. What is with the scary you ringtone? You deserve praise and a reward. Listen. I'm doing everything I can to stay under the radar. I'll call in 
keep sending me these old recordings of mom. Maybe because they haven't figured it out themselves, Nancy. It's kind of trippy that it's the same voice actor. I kind of, or actress. I kind of wish they did a different voice actress. It sounds too much like Nancy. Screwdriver. Oh, breakfast, a fry up, black pudding, pork sausage, porridge with salt, Scottish breakfast, full traditional breakfast, and kippers, pickled herring. Bread and pastries, Scott pie, meat pastry. Buttery is a savory Aberdeen roey. A banock is oat cakes. Dundee cake, traditional fruit cake topped with almonds. A black bun, fruit cake, and a pastry crust. So are these just the different foods that are popular in Scotland? You mean your mom I don't have identical voices? <laughs> no. Does you? Does your mom? It tells us what they are. I know, this is great. Where is the, uh, whatever, okay. Colon skink, smoke. They were singing the Ole song. Um, smoked haddock, onions and potato stew, Scottish beef, Aberdeen, Angus steak, haggis, national dish of Scotland. Smoked haddock is smokies. Stovies, dye, slam potatoes, onion and gravy. Col col cannon, potatoes, cabbage and onions with cheddar. <gasps> Meats and toddies, mashed turnips and potatoes. That's it, so neeps are turnips. Oh, turnips. Neeps. Uh, Cockaleeky chicken and leek soup, Parton Brie crab soup, a Clooney dumpling, boiled fruit pudding, Krenachan, Krenachan, um, cream parfait with honey, oatmeal and berries, Strathbogie mist, pears with flavored cream, and a tablet fudge like sweet confection. Oh, I could take that. <laughs> Oh, this is closed for a private event. Darn it, let me in. Sounds like they're having fun. All right, is that it? That's all? Really? Okay. <clears throat> Turnips? <laughs> That's what it's got to be, though, right? Um, okay, so we did that. That's done. And we did Check. explore the train station. Track down more information about Mom's past with Cathedral and Moira. Oh, here he's back. I think I found your friend. Great! Where? Fair warning. She's a hitter. She hit me. Did you provoke her? Well, just a little. Why is she so important? She wrote an article I thought was pretty interesting. About hitting strangers, no doubt. She's out in Bearston. You can take the train out there. Bearston. You know what? The guy, the voice changer, it's definitely a guy, so could be him. Could be him. Have you heard of Revenant? Like the fancy word for ghost? Yeah. Oh, right. That's what no, that it means? wasn't a ghost. It was proper, like he was kitted out in one of them toxes and snacking on a canopy. What? <laughs> snacking on a canopy? Okay, sir. All right. Revenant is supposedly a terrorist group. <laughs> You've never heard of them? Nope. So hardly terrifying. They're more of an obscurist group. Nothing. You've heard nothing about this group. No. That's odd. And neither have you. Oh, so he has. The same Moira she was talking to at the beginning? Wait, she was talking to Moira at the beginning? Oh, you mean Nancy's mom? Hey, yes. kids. We're assuming. I need to know, are you really who you say you are? Why? That means no. It does. But I'm a friend, and I did save your life back there. Doesn't that buy me a bit of goodwill? Uh, agreeing to find my suitcase was nice. I'd hardly call that saving my life. I was perfectly happy in my routine. Taking jobs, making money, crumpets. Everything that could be good was good. 
Then I met you, went out of my way to keep your present tense, and yet the sass. You want to know about me? Tell me about you, until you're ready to do that. Leave me alone. I'm not leaving until you tell me what's going on. This Great, voice sounds I enjoy your company. What? Nothing until you tell me what's going on. All right, I'll tell you about myself if I can get some answers in return. Thank you. Why are you here? I want to learn more about my mother. All right, what do you really do for a living? Exactly what I told you. What do you want to know about your mother? She left home one day. I don't know why. My dad begged her not to go, and she didn't listen. She died here. I don't think it was an accident. Why not? No, my turn. Is someone paying you to keep an eye on me? That's enough. That was fun. <gasps> so it's true! Okay. Alright, we need to go to Beerstein now. To find more room. Ooh, this is a cute little house. See, he's so sus. That's so weird. Oh, hi, FF. I was looking to see if you were streaming earlier, so happy surprise. Hi. I hope you're having a good Sunday. <clears throat> yeah, he was just there conven conveniently. Yeah, he's suspicious. What's this? I wish you once I'll hit you again. Are you looking for a smack? Moira, what? No. I really need to talk to you. It's important. If you want to talk, come back with some food. Oh, that accent. Are you an American? Yes. You don't know anything about Scottish food. I'll give you simple names. Get me the oatmeal parfait, turnips and potatoes, haddock, and a bit of fudge if you would. I'm on it. Okay, so she wants some neeps and tatties. Some turnips and tatties. Um, and she wanted some fudge, so a tablet. So she wants neeps and toddies, a tablet. She's asking for a lot of food, isn't she? What else did she want? Um, haddock? What is haddock? Oh, smoked haddock. So smokies. What is that? What's haddock, chat? I don't actually know. Um, and an oatmeal parfait. Uh, oatmeal parfait. Oh, maybe a Kranachan cream parfait with honey, oatmeal, and berries. Maybe that. So, Kranachan tablet, neeps and toddies, and smokies. Alright, let's go buy it. We're gonna... Oh, haddock is fish. Oh, you're right. It is fish. Where's the exit? We need to go buy her food. Uh-oh. You're in Scotland? How did you know? Never mind how I know. That's not the point. You're deflecting. Guilty. You don't have my permission to be in Scotland. Come home right now. Uh -oh. Your permission? Your I think I'm mad. a little too old for that. What you're too old for is running <laughs> headfirst into a dangerous situation and leaving the rest of us to clean up after you. What is with you right now? Well, Calm your down. Mom died here. Of Nancy, course he's gonna you don't be get worried. It. I'm not angry at you. <laughs> Could have fooled me. I'm scared. Please just come home. Aww. Why are you gonna be so difficult? Why are you being so difficult? Nancy, if I help you, I'm so pushing mean. you right to whoever has lured you there. I can handle myself. Your mother said the same thing. <gasps> oh God. Who is Moira? Who is Moira Chisholm? Stay away from her. My source at Cathedral wants me to find her. Cathedral? I don't know what to tell you then. Can I have mom's notes? No. It might be helpful. I bet it would be extremely helpful, but no, you really can't. They're gone. Gone? Where? I shredded them. You what? What? Remember when you picked the lock on that filing cabinet? Which one? I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that. To my <laughs> knowledge, it was just the one. I mean, which one? The only one ever? That one? I knew you were looking for her notes, so I shredded everything. So, it's all lost? It's all lost. Oh, how could you do that? I thought it might prevent you from doing what you're doing right now. <sighs> Talk to you later. Goodbye. Alright, let's also call Ned. He's hey, mad mad. Nancy, what's going on? 
Your dad wanted me to book a flight to Scotland. <gasps> yeah, I knew that might happen. I did not. What's going on? Your dad seemed really upset. He is. He thinks I'm in danger. And he's just now noticing this? Yeah, he seems to think that it's different this time. He might be right. Well, tell me, what's happening? Ned, uh, how cute would it be if Ned actually did come to Scotland? <laughs> that would be sweet. Hi, animals. Thanks. I had my bag stolen at the train station. Oh, no. Did you lose anything valuable? This poem I had, it was my mom's. She wrote it? No, it was her favorite poem, Jabberwocky. That poem Jabberwocky. is confusing. <laughs> All the good ones are. I prefer haiku. Easier to understand. I see what you did. Well, at least you can replace it. No, that's the thing. I can't. My mom had marked it up in this strange way. Who do you mean? She color-coded it in the book. I always thought it was a code, but my dad was really weird about all of her things, so I was only ever able to make a copy. The original is still there? I think so. Goodbye. Thanks. Bye. Well, then, we'll have to do that. Hi, Arg. Happy Sunday. I got that book you wanted. Here you go. Scotland, a traveler's Thanks. guide. Bye. See you around. See you later. Here's the book. Um, I'll read it. Occupying the northern third of Great Britain, Scotland's wealth of history and scenery offers something for every traveler. Big scenery abounds from the beauty of the valleys in the south to the inspiring highlands of the north. History permeates the weather-worn castles and stunning architecture. Culinary masterpieces highlighting <laughs> local flavors are served in restaurants across the nation and everywhere you go. The welcoming and friendly locals will be there to help you on your way. They don't seem so friendly. They're like, ugh, American. Um, Edinburgh. The capital of Scotland is the most popular city for tourists in the co country. Be sure to visit the numerous museums and architectural treasures in Old Town and New Town, where stunning views from Edinburgh Castle and soaking up history at the National Museum of Scotland are not to be missed. Edinburgh also hosts numerous festivals throughout the year, including the world famous International Film Festival, the International Jazz and Blues Festival, and the Military Tattoo. Glasgow, with world-class art galleries, plentiful parks, and chic restaurants and clubs, modern Glasgow offers more than its in industrial image of old. The city's origins trace back to the 6th century and the Saint Mungo, patron saint of the city, whose crypt, who, whose crypt rests in the lower church of the magnificent Glasgow Cathedral. For art lovers, the Burrell Collection and the Kelvin Grove Art Gallery and museum have some of the finest collections in all of Great Britain. Glasgow boasts a teeming nightlife and some of the finest shopping in the nation. Southern Scotland, consisting of the borders in Dumfries and Galloway, the rolling hills of the rural south may have more resident sheep than people, but a wealth of historical sites around abound in the area. Visit the ruins of Caer Lavra Castle, the ancient abbeys of Dryber, Dryber and Jedburg, or the planted, I'm probably saying all this wrong, but whatever. Planted grounds of the Logan Botanic Garden, Scotland's literary figures are well represented in the region with Sir Walter Scott's home at Abbotsford, the star attraction. Central Scotland, located between Glasgow and Edinburgh, and Edinburgh, the and the highlands central scotland is largely farmland and forest the country's first national park the trossachs adjoins the legendary loch lomond on the western edge on the eastern shore in st andrews the home of golf and site of the famous st andrew links golf course scotland's history of inventors is represented at falkirk where visitors can see the Falkirk Wheel, the world's first rotating boat lift in action. The Highlands, making up nearly half of, Scot of the Scottish mainland, the rugged splendor of the Highlands provides some of the most breathtaking views in the country. Visit the Isle of Skye, to which Bonnie Prince Charlie fled after his defeat at Culloden, 
or take a picture of the famously photographed Eileen Donan Castle. The area is also rich in clan history and traditions, including the infamous betrayal at Glencoe between the McDonald's and the Campbells. Ooh, betrayal, you say. <laughs> More sheep than people, it sounds like whales, <laughs> does it? <laughs> I've never been to Europe. I would love to go sometime. Uh, Orkney and Shetland Islands, located off the northern end of the nation, the remote location of the Orkney and Shetland Islands make these isles a little visited destination. Hi, Elle. Thanks for the 75 months. Hello. That was a very big betrayal. I wouldn't know. Outlander fans will recognize this lore. I think I've seen one episode of Outlands. Or Outlander. Outlander? Outlander. And I haven't seen more. It looked good though. Hi, Elle! For tourists who do visit the area, they're treated to some of the best prehistoric monuments in Europe. Skara Bray, the Stones of Sinis. And ancient burial tombs can be found on Orkney, while Shetland is home to the Jarlshof Prehistoric and Norse Settlement. The islands are also home to nature preserves where millions of seabirds congregate for the breeding season each year. I'm probably going to need to know this later. Oh, this is a timeline. Macbeth murders Duncan to become king. Edward defeated by William Wallace at the Battle of Stirling Bridge. Robert the Bruce becomes King of Scotland. Battle of Benoff Burn for Scottish independence. Declaration of Arbroath recognizes Scotland's independence from England. Mary Queen of Scots forced to abdicate the throne. Abdicate throne. Um, Acts of Union unite Scotland and England as Great Britain. World's first golf club, the Honorable Company of Edinburgh Golfers is formed and Bonnie Prince Charlie returns to Scotland. <laughs> Okay, that was a lot. A lot of history there. We watched the first season and we're too tra traumatized to continue. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. A few episodes in, the first season were really heavy if you weren't ready for it. Huh. Interesting. They said, see, July 14th. Wait, no, today is July 14th. Because this is a new paper, I think. Anyways, we need to buy the food, darn it. Okay, what do we need? to get everything Moira asked for. Smokies. Great, that's one of the things on her list. Now to get the rest. Okay, so that's the haddock. We need the neeps and tackies. And then we needed the crunchan, the parfait. And then I believe a tablet, because it has fun. That's inside. everything. Now to Baron's so to deliver this to Moira. I want a tablet. It sounds yummy. It has fudge on the inside. Who doesn't like fudge? Okay, and then we need to go back here. All right, I got what you wanted. Now please, I need to talk to you about my mother. Her name was Kate Drew. Nancy, I had no idea. I would never have... Please, come in. Well, now she's doing nice. Here? Just she visiting. She was just angry. <laughs> Your mother would shrug a bit whenever she was lying. Now I see it's genetic. You knew my mother? Kate Drew? Quite well. We wrote for the same newspaper. I knew you too. What? There's a photo. Go on, take a look. <gasps> That's me? Oh. <laughs> Indeed it is. Believe it or not, I was once your favorite person in the world. But mainly because I snuck you sweets when Kate and Carson weren't looking. I'm so sorry. That's sweet. That's I a sweet photo. I just don't remember. I guess I didn't really expect you to. You were quite small the last time I saw you. Clearly. See that tea set? Uh-huh. Yeah. You'll notice the lack of teacups. That's because you broke every single cup. Sorry I was an accidental terror. <laughs> accidental. Please, get back here. Nothing That's accidental about photo. it. You'd make eye contact, grin that vicious little grin you had, and smash! Then you'd laugh like it was the funniest thing in the whole world. Oh, I must have been a nightmare. Yeah, you were. <laughs> Sorry? You have no idea how good it is to see you. Who is that? Was anyone following you? Not that I know of. Hide. Now. What's going on? No! Oh. Oh, God. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Huh. 
Hide? Where am I hiding? Oh, here. Keep looking. Would you look at that? What? I was. <laughs> what? <the? laughs> okay, clearly we cannot hide there. What in the world? This went from like a one to like a ten. All of a sudden, in action. Hi, Michaela. I've never seen anyone play Nancy Drew. Oh my god, I love these games. Well, where am I supposed to hide? Uh, under. Oh, maybe in here? Stay put and don't make a sound. Oh, okay. No matter what you hear. What? Shh. There's a safe behind the breaker. Look under the teapot. Follow what you find to the safe house. Safe house? What's going on? If it's starting again, no one can know you're here. Ah, oh, gentlemen. You must be here to abduct me. Oh, come. Is that really necessary? Oh, my God! <laughs> what the world? There's been... A kidnapping! <laughs> I can't even see what the heck we just casually listened to a kidnapping. Well then. Cool. Oh, what's this? Oh. Okay, we'll figure that out later. Hmm. Well, here's a record. Oh, okay. <gasps> God, I did not like that sound. <laughs> okay. So she said something about... That's such a cute photo! Why don't we have that photo? I hope Moira gives us a copy of that or just gives this it to us. This must be the number Moira referenced for the fuses. One, eight, five. Oh, this is the fuses. Or for the fuses. One, eight, five. That's a pretty big TV. Very, uh, got one little, oh, two windows. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> Pays to look around, chat. Do you think there's any money? <gasps> what is this? Nothing? Any money here? Look at our cute little kitchen. It's a quaint little room. Oh, God. Clan Tartans of Scotland. Oh, so this is a tartan. Hi, Steve. Cool. So these are the different names. All right, got the Duncan, got the Elliot, got the McGregor, the McKenzie. Okay, probably gonna need those for later. Ooh, I can take it. Um, can't look in that bag. That's the exit. Where is all the food that we gave her? Okay, I guess that's it. Uh, tartan, there is a Mackie tartan. Was there really? Where? Oh, you mean just in general, like in the world? I need to flip the fuses to equal the number from the teapot. I guess I don't need these. I need to flip the fruit, what? Oh. What was it? 185? I already forgot the number. That's it was done. 185. <laughs> I was actually just totally playing around. Can't check. Wow. Did that? Haven't done. Still have to do that. I got it. This must be for the safe house in Loch Lamond. Ah, Loch Lamond. M, thank you for the letters. I am fine now. To be honest, I let the letters build up. 
I won't smooth that over with excuses. I know that it's not your fault. Everything went south, but I don't think it's likely I'll be returning. I'm sorry that's where I've landed, but you know why. I'll still look for your letters in the mail, and you can look for mine in the post. If you leave the file, I've got a room for you here. I know you won't. I regret bringing you in more than anything. Carson's fine. Still spits fire at the mention of your name, which I'm sure will make you smile a bit. Nancy's good like she always is. She picked up at my habit of asking strangers the exact questions, questions she shouldn't. It makes Carson nuts, but it cracks me up. Okay. Kate. Oh, see, these are all her notes. Or letters, I guess, to her. Did you luck into again? I did. <laughs> that happens so often for you. I think it's just a trait now. You should add it to my resume. <laughs> Speed running puzzles. I do still have my notes. You'll find them at the safe house. You must know that curiosity is twisting my neurons into knots of pure agitation. That's fine. I'll let that happen. You're a monster. So, all right, I have to know a little. No names, okay? Just tell me about the pattern. And was I right? H has it started up again? I don't know what this is. Can I, maybe I should take a photo of this. Thank you, by the way, guys, for all the likes. Probably need that later. Uh, all right, let me know. A, let me know a little. Just a date. Don't send anything else. It's not the same date, but I know this handwriting. Is it R? I can't come back in. I'm not coming back in. Not a word to Carson or anyone in Cathedral. But look, here's what still weird for me. The pattern we spotted. Why was it gone for so long? The night of the wave break. Did we really hit too close to home on that one? If so, that accounts for the long silence. I mean, it's been years since we've caught anything. So did we scare them into silence for a minute there? Or did we just lose the thread at that point? I'll help you for the time being, but you've got to get another analyst on board, okay? I've got enough of the notes in my head, but I still need... I but I need you to hit me with the specific dates and locations for all of the events. We subscribe to three papers. You can guess which ones. Draw up everything into the want ads. I'm a sucker for the Lonely Hearts ads. Give me a reason to read them. Cute ads. Sad though. I know you remember what we learned in school and then again in interrogation training. That every joke travels with a bit of truth in its pocket. Moira, you're clearly lonely. I realize I'm the last person on earth who should give relationship advice as I'm the benefactor of an obscene amount of what my mother called love luck. Carson dropped into my life and that's that. I'm still waiting for the other shoe to drop squarely on my nose. Luckily, luck like this is unnerving. Aw, <laughs> that's cute. She's talking about Nancy's dad or her husband. So it was luck, love luck. Oof, my, my eye. You know, when I approached you with a job at the paper, I hope this doesn't cheapen our friendship in your eyes, but I made a project of you. You were so brutally competitive and populate your own list of com compliments. You know what I think of you. I set my mark on you and you on me. We became close friends, graduated, and parted ways. I kept reading your work, and you were still so much better with words than I could hope to be. When your articles stopped appearing, I got very worried. I searched for your byline everywhere, found nothing. Then I found out why. My heart went out to you. Michael would be furious with you right now, you know. He loved you and the last thing he'd ever want is for you to sit the rest of your life out. Aww, is, was Michael Moira, Moira's like husband? Did he die? I helped you back on your feet because I couldn't think of a better person to do the same for me when my time to fall flat on my face came around. By the way, you were hilariously suspicious at first. Can't say I blame you. Losing Michael was a kick to the gut, and anyone who looked you in the eye could see you waiting for the next blow to land. You found your way back, got writing again, but the look you had then, you still have it today. If true love means never having to say you're sorry, then true friendship between reporters means never having to break out the grease pencil. Fine, here it is one last time. He's dead, you're not. 
Go to his grave tomorrow and say goodbye. He loved you and if he had a voice to speak, it would beg you to stop torturing yourself. Back to the numbers, I'm selling a bunch of used garden equipment in the papers of record. Tell me if you think I got it right. Interesting. Oh, that's sad though. I heard you loud and clear. Drive at your own chosen speed. But the numbers, how sure are you that I'm right? I don't know what these numbers are. All right, the situation is bad. How many papers are in here? All right, the situation is bad. Stand by. The next letter is going to come to you via courier. Tune into the declaration of our growth. Okay. All right. Oh, we're going to take that. I wonder what I'll need to open up this box. A code, Nancy. A code. All right. Well, we got everything. Can I watch the TV? I guess it's not until later. All right, where is this safe house that she was talking about? Is this, is this it? I think this is it. Is there any money in the couch? Can we leave? Okay, seems like it. Haven't done that. Haven't done, that's done. So we need to escape to the safe house. Well, where'd she say the safe house was? I love how this says, Moyer was escorted away by someone I didn't see. Slash kidnap, Nancy. Why are you trying to downplay it? Have you played this one before? If I did, it was a really long time ago. Part of me does not think that I played this at all. Because I don't remember anything of it. Oh, Lock Lamont. I think that's where I need to go. How selfish you're being right now! Nancy, is everything okay? Bess, something's going on. It's bad. Whoa, Thank young God Nancy. Okay. Bess still sounds no, insane. No, you're not doing this. Keep it down. You made me a promise. This is more important. What do you want me to tell Nancy? Huh? That, that her mom doesn't care enough about her to stay? Just leave then. Run off to Scotland. Oh, Whoa. grow up, Carson. Over. Wow, the heck? Ooh, that's pretty. I thought Ghost Dog was much older. I couldn't. See, I wish I could have put. Um, I'm playing Nancy Drew with the Silent Spy, but TikTok doesn't have that as a category, so I just chose one of the random ones. But yes, Ghost Dogs is older, but that's not what I'm playing. I couldn't choose Nancy Drew the Silent Spy. It wasn't on the list. That's crazy. He was aggressive. Then, but then Nancy's mom slammed the door on her way out. But sheesh. Sheesh. Oh, money. Let's go this way first. It's locked. Ooh. Let me in. Screwdriver. Cheers! Bray Arena. Ooh. Cool, it's like a gym. It looks like <gasps> it's missing a part. Bagpipes? Huh? What is that? Hmm. Huh. We're gonna have to play bagpipes? <laughs> uh, anything over here? Oh, ooh, punching bag. Ooh, get him, get him, Nancy, get him, get him. Gotta practice. I thought we had the key. Oh yeah, we do. <laughs> Whoops, we do have the key, I forgot. Well, I guess we, it doesn't hurt to look in here. Oh, nope. Is there anything else? Oops. Information. Mastering the bow, a beginner's guide to archery. Oh, I actually know all about archery, actually. We got the, the long bow, the recurve bow, the compound bow. I used a compound bow when I did archery. The 
Great Highland bagpipe. Oh boy. I'll take a photo of this for later. We'll probably need this, especially the things at the bottom here. Oh, I can keep it. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, finding money everywhere. People leave money everywhere. You must visit Nottingham with your archery skills, Kylie. I, I don't think I would call them good archery skills, Ian, but thank you. <laughs> I love that we're gonna play bagpipes. What was this? High scores. There's a lot of Kates. Why is there so many Kates? Kate. Amazing, Kate Spade, Kate Say, Kate Sace, Kate Amazing. Oh, is this Moira and Kate? Interesting. Twist of Kate. <laughs> Not a bullseye. <laughs> Wait, how do I? How Let's do give I, this oh. a shot. Whoa! The heck, Nancy? Oh, you have to like really do it early. This is like, this actually was me. An archery. Oh my god, look at that! Oh, bullseye! Ugh, so close. <laughs> I got 47. What does that make me? <gasps> Number one! I'm pretty pleased with this development. Number one, number uno. Oh wait, did y'all like my joke this morning? How do you make number one disappear? You add a G and it's gone. <laughs> that fits, that fits. All right, anything else we can click on? I don't think so. All right, let's go to the safe house. I freaking just got a bow for free. You don't know how expensive these bows are? That's done. A lot. Thousand dollars, maybe more. Ooh, this is so pretty. All right, let's go into the safe house. Wow. Didn't they say something about the stones? The stones, chat, the stone. That's a big fish. Got some granola. Why, what? What is this? Nothing? Oh, aha. Okay. Ooh, TV. Moira's notes mention something about tuning in. I should figure out what station she meant. Always gotta try that, you know. Mary, Queen of Scots, brief history. What the heck? Fireplace, plastic. Okay. My bow is about 1400, so they're expensive. Sounds about right. Our friends will be arriving soon, so I need to go pick up uh, the guest room. See you guys tomorrow. Have fun, Lulu. Hi, Auklik. How are you? Shall we read this? After being forced to advocate her throne to her one-year-old son, James, in 1567, Mary, Queen of Scots, fled Scotland. She sought refuge in England, presuming that her cousin, Queen Elizabeth, would assist her in reclaiming her Scottish throne. She was mistaken. Elizabeth had no heir of her own, making her cousin Mary the next in line for the throne of England. Elizabeth's right to the crown was under question by certain Catholic factions who believed Protestant Elizabeth was an illegitimate child of Henry VIII and therefore unfit to rule. Under her reasoning, this left Catholic Mary with the strongest claim to the English throne. 
When Mary arrived in England, Elizabeth had her cousin imprisoned. Um, uh, Elizabeth had her cousin in prison. Mary spent the next 19 years under house arrest. Jeez. Believing she was meant to be the ruler of England, Mary eventually conspired against Elizabeth. The Babington plot, as it became known, was planned through coded correspondence between Mary and Anthony Babington. The letters were intercepted by Elizabeth's spies, who successfully decoded the nomenclature cipher used by Mary and her conspirators. The proof was irrefutable, and Mary was convicted of treason and sentenced to death. It took multiple strokes to complete the job when Mary was beheaded on February 8, 1587. Multiple strokes. Yikes. Yikes. Yikes, indeed. Yikes. Um, anything else? There's a little radio. A little umbrella. Some beds. Um, okay. of Arbroath. So maybe the date of the declaration of Arbroath. Do we have that? Here we go. Maybe this? Aha! Declaration of Arbroath. Recognize Scotland's independence. So April, maybe 1320? Maybe 1320? Oh wait, we probably need April, so April 1320. Ha! That was a pretty cool cutscene for Nancy Drew! <laughs> what the heck? That was so cool! Wow! Good job! Nice! Her interactive, that's where the budget went right there. <laughs> Everything else is downhill now, I'm sorry. Whoa, that was cool looking. <laughs> okay, what do we got here? Uh-oh. Nancy, come see me. I've put a card in your safe. Your password is your room number times the price of a serving of haggis at the deli outside the hotel. Why? Why not? Why? <laughs> Why? Who is Ewan? Have we met him yet? Messages. Nancy, I made it through all right and I'm back home. The situation here is worse than I had feared. If you're staying, be careful and keep your head down. Moira. I asked very nicely at the desk and now I have your phone number. How great is that? Bridget. What the heck, Bridget? Freaking <laughs> stalker. She's definitely suspicious, man. Wow, that was cool, though. There goes 90% of the budget. <laughs> Hi, Petito! How you doing? How was, um, uh, uh, shadowing? Are you still shadowing? Was it only for, like, a day, or have you been doing it a lot? Cool. What the heck? Okay, so we got some Jabberwocky. files. I knew that was important. Jabberwocky. M, remember what we used to say? If ever we need to run, beware the Jabberwock, my son. Thinking of that poem today and the colorful language. Jabberwock reminds me of the Jabberwockies. It was like this, like, so you think you can dance show. I remember watching when I was younger and the Jabberwockies was like the name of one of the dance crew. And they were so good. I remember watching that and they won. Sorry, unrelated, but... Great reaction, a game always saying why to a code that is giving. <laughs> like, why would you give, just give me the darn code and I'll be there. Bear had to memorize that a few years ago. It was so fun. Um, wait, what did he have to memorize? The poem, the Jabberwock poem? They told, wait, it was fun, I finished on Thursday. They told me if they got any jobs, they'll call me and that I can, uh, just go to the office. What, what do you mean by just go to the office? But awesome! I hope I hope a job opens up for you. 
That's where they get their crew name, Lewis Carroll's Jabberwocky. You know what I'm talking about though, Madrona, right? So it was a I've no I don't know the Jabberwock poem. I don't think I've heard it. Well, we'll, we'll find out, apparently. I'm stuck, and you're stuck listening to me think out loud. The name means something. Colony. Colony. I've looked at every colony I could think of. Maybe the name is a joke? Or maybe it's a reference to how colonists came in small numbers with superior technology and authority and they just, and they take over. Or maybe it's bees? Maybe it's a way to kill the queen and keep the hive? Not the literal queen. If there, if there are MI5 eyes on this, nobody panic. It's a metaphor. Or would it be, or would be if it made more sense? What I keep coming back to are those events. I knew I was onto something when I started following the story at the Standard. I knew I was really onto something when Cathedral was as interested as I was, but that was years back. Why haven't I figured it out yet? I have a fever. I do some of my best and worst thinking with a fever. You know that. This is either the former or the latter. No clue. Why did it stop so suddenly? That's what scares me. Pretend you're a bad guy for a second. You know, you now have this ability to make groups of unrelated strangers react in a somewhat predictable fashion. You spend years perfecting it, and then once your proof of concept is completed, you're not going to just walk away from that. Now think about this, and think about Colony, the ultimate attempt at a bloodless coup. Remember what we sat, remember when we sat in on the epidemiology report? It takes about 20% of the population to become infected at the same time to cripple a city. I need to sleep. This is probably just as long as the notes that we had, I'm assuming. <sighs> it's a bunch of nonsense-ish words, but so fun for a kid to memorize. Hmm. Yeah, they're a famous crew. Um, oh, like I can just drive up and go in. Wait, so they wouldn't even need an interview or anything? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, man, I really hope a job opens up. I hope they open up one literally for you. That'd be nice. Hi, Tuna. Um, M, thinking about future uses of, uses of colony. I need to. It's my job, but I hate it. It's too terrible. Give a man a hammer, he'll build a house. Because he can. Give that same man a sledgehammer, he'll knock the walls out of that house. Because he can't help himself. What is this? What is this? It doesn't make any sense at all. I knew this reminded me of something. The way Revenant acts, they, the way, acts, they way, maybe, they, the way they play with people. Remember the article I wrote about Edward Bernays? Bernays? The pioneer of public relations? I know you remember because you begged me to shut up about it, but I was stuck on it. Sigmund Freud's nephew takes everything he learns from his uncle and applies the understanding of human weakness in a very large scale manner. Bernays knew what drives us and he taught advertisers how to harness and redirect those drives to the highest bidder. You know that feeling you have when you need something at the store but you can't figure out why? That's him. What if someone wanted to harness that same power but on a larger scale? Ooh, what was that sound? Thank you guys for the follows and all the likes. That's very sweet of you. Um, what if someone wanted to redraw the map of the world without wars by just convincing us we need to do, do whatever it is we're told? I know I sound crazy. I used to think Revenant was crazy, but what if I'm right? What if they really are experimenting? A way to wage war without war would be noble if it weren't so scary at the same time. M, I'm running now. Put the scientists and family on a plane, play, play the pipes, read the letters as they appear from left to right. It's done. I stopped it. Until R pulls out of the city, I'm in huge danger. You are too. If they find me, you have to burn everything. Not even the agency can be trusted. Take it all offline. You'll be caught and they'll burn you. But you know you owe me this. If I'm not around to drive all the nails into Colony's coffin, you have to. At cafe you hate, leaving through the kitchen. Live or die, this is goodbye. Jeez. Okay. <laughs> that was uh, a lot. What is this? I don't know what that is. What is this? Password. And hence. <laughs> 
Is that a reference? Uh, I hope so. I was shocked when they told me I could shadow that same day. They did tell me that I know more about theater sound than they all they all do, so fingers crossed. Oh, I hope so. What is Nancy dealing with? I... <laughs> a lot right now. Um, we're learning more about her mother's death. Because apparently her mother's death wasn't an accident. She was murdered. I need to figure out how to press these stones in the right order. She did say left to right, right? So... Well, but I don't know- what? It can't be that easy. Okay. Can't check that off. Did that. That's done. Haven't done- did- haven't- still have to do that. Track down the color copy of the Jabberwocky poem. Get the key from my room. Oh yeah, Can't we check still, that off we yet. Have to do that. Thanks guys for all the likes. How did the interview? It didn't go. It's this Wednesday. I got the weeks mixed up. It's this Wednesday. How am I supposed to know? Read the letters as they appear from left to right. Read the letters as they appear from left to right. I V A O R P. Is that a word? <laughs> this is probably not the same thing. <laughs> something different but I'm assuming this is what it is <laughs> but I don't know what this would spell do y'all see any words <laughs> I don't know at least you're more ready now right uh yeah for <laughs> use that time still to practice still can't, that's, that's yo know, haven't that done that me. all right well maybe we can come back here later let's come back here let's go get that key from nancy's hotel or the place she's staying at oh here he is hey kid why are you still hanging out here i'm a big fan of announcements and i gotta love a shrill beep now and again wait for it huh who doesn't? I need to kick off at a second sometimes, and I get sick of rushing over. Then, it grew on me. I like watching travelers, trying to imagine the worlds they carry with them in their heads, and I got a thing for the crumpets here. I think I could have been a great professor of psychology, but I never could sit in a chair, now could I? Okay. Have you been sending me messages? No, and the way you say that makes me think these aren't your standard messages. You could say that. If anyone is threatening you, I need to know right now. Why? Because. Common courtesy. I don't find that particularly reassuring since I'm not sure who is after me. Great, I've been meaning to ask you about follow? that. Right now, you and I have about the same amount of information. And unless you actually know something... Eh? He's so weird. Talk to you later. Why isn't he? Bye. Whose side is he on? Is he on Cathedral side or is he on the the other enemy side? That what is it called? Revenant. Revenant. The heck? What the heck, guys? All right, let's go to Nancy's room. Wait, how much? They said something about a haggis, right? The room number is what did they say? It was Nancy's room number. I can't remember her room number right now, but I'll look at it. Multiplied by the price of haggis? Is that what it, the guy said? The code, my room number times the price of a serving of haggis. 
So it's five. Oh, let's talk Where to her. Where were you? I wasn't sure if you had a party or if you got murdered. Either way, it would have been nice to be invited. I went to spend a little time at a cabin. Who just goes to a cabin by themselves? Shut up! Did you bring Alec? You know Alec? I know he's not into me, but no, I see why. Alec did not come with me, and how do you know about him anyway? I'm not here to judge. Well, there's nothing to judge. Let me check the docket. Hmm. May I refer you to the case of Tree versus Nancy and Alec? Tree alleges K-I-S-S. -S. Ugh, enough! Oh, fine, I believe you. I'm just jealous. I-N-G. See you around. See you later. I'm Nancy Bounding as her today, chat. Except I'm not, hopefully I'm not that annoying. Uh -huh. Wait, what was, wait, 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 what's that? There's an owl. An owl. Is there anything here that I can click on? No. The best character? She's definitely unique. <laughs> this girl does need to chill. Okay, so what, okay, 727, 727 multiplied by Haggis. So 3635. Math. My luggage. <gasps> Alec must have had it delivered. Yay. Wait a second. Mom's stuff is missing. <gasps> Did no. Alec take it? <gasps> he took it. Oh, money. That's some nice pants, Nancy. So her luggage? So she... Alec is the guy at the train station, right? Yeah, it must what be him. What did Ewan say was the code to get we in We haven't met again? Ewan, though, right? Three, six, three, five. Lodge elevator service. Hmm. So that means, what does that mean? Nothing else in here? Anything else in our room? Jump, Nancy! This music is really calming. Ah. Sounds depressing, actually. Okay, so let's go in the elevator. Oops. I need to use the key card Ewan gave me to activate this panel. That's new. It must be part of Cathedral security. Ah, oh, Nancy, what's up? Pretty impressive, huh? Are you my cathedral contact? My code name is Yun. And before Yui. you ask, no, I did not choose it. What but in I the world? Something better. Shadow, blizzard, or some better word that doesn't also sound like a name you'd give a horse. Whoa, this area is so cool. We're in the secret spy headquarter. Real covert, Nancy. <laughs> This is cool, though. Can you look into Alec Fell for me? Aye. Nice. All right, we have lots of questions. Is Cathedral a part of MI5? It is, and yet it is not. I understand. And yet you don't. I love duplicity. And yet... You hate it. There's my girl. I like your style. But... No, I genuinely do. So it's not part of Cathedral? What exactly do you do here? In the intelligence game, the dumb ones get manipulated, and the clever ones get buried. And the particularly clever ones? Well, they win, of course. But that's most likely not you. No offense, it's not me either. The creepy messages I'm getting on my phone. Who do you think is sending them? I've been trying to track the source of the message. Grats await the mysterious stranger who coded that monstrosity. Hmm, interesting. I have Wolf. We actually played it last stream. It was fun. We didn't get to the part where you could like investigate through caves and kill bosses though. Um, I don't know when that's unlocked, but yes, we have played. I played with two of my friends. Do you know who Kate Drew was? Aye, we all do. I know she's your mom. You can call her that. So, she really wasn't a reporter? 
She was, and was quite good. But she was also one of ours. A spy? Aye. What or who was she spying on? Figured you'd want to know. I gave you basic clearance on the archives. There is a station set up for you along the wall. Ooh, okay. How did my mom stop the attack? Your mother isolated the man who was orchestrating the attack. And of course he knew nothing and had nothing that could lead back to Revenant. All he could say was whatever he needed had a way of appearing. And the same person never visited him twice. No one knew what they were bringing him or why. It was perfectly and alarmingly decentralized. Hmm. Spy mom. My mom's a cool mom. And a spy. You've been playing with your mom and sister? Wait, how nice. That sounds fun. So what exactly does Revenant want? Back in the days of mud huts and the like, mud some huts? years the harvests would be light. Sometimes, when that happened, two kings would meet and plan a war to thin their flocks. Then, no one would ever know of their failures. That is what Revenant wants. They don't want to take over the world. They want to keep it. Okay. Interesting. Well, as fun as sibling rivalry, rivalry while playing a game is. <laughs> Why are you my contact? In order to do my job, I have to have top information clearance. But I'm not an agent per se. Civilian liaison work often falls to me. If you're asking what that means, you may not like the answer. May not? Absolutely won't. You're not considered a player. You're considered an asset. You're more or less on your own. You get to chat with me, and that's it. Lucky me. Wait, why does it have to be sibling rivalry? Y'all are sharing like the same money, right? If you're playing the game. One of the few times mom has been told us to stop yelling at each other. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> Just kidding. Are you the one who sent me the Get message to come to Scotland? No. Do you know who did? Nope. Do you know why? Yes, in fact I do. Someone thinks you have special insight into the secrets that were lost with Kate Drew. I don't. Well, perhaps you do. How about you get caught up on the basics first before making up your mind? Who is Revenant? We do not know exactly. That's just what we're calling him. I'm seeing a pattern. Look at that pie chart. That pattern is called chaos. That's some serious simply put, spy work. They're the bad guys. Less simply put? In this game of cat and mouse, we thought we were the cat. But you're the mouse. We're the mouse. They're the trap. Mm. What is your role with Cathedral? I'm the watcher in the wires. I protect the status quo. And, for the time being, <laughs> Watcher you. in the wires. <laughs> is that another name for a hacker? This sounds like fancier. I'm the watcher of the wire in the wires chat. <laughs> I love that, actually. What do you mean by protect the status quo? Society rides on a rail, like a trolley. The rails are solid and modest and predictable. Those are your disc types. They get married, they have some kids, buy a house they can't afford, and never again are they unpredictable, or interesting, or alive even. But the catenary line, the third rail, that's what drives the world forward. People that have a charge running through them, they move the world forward. Or they try to destroy it. I make sure that won't happen. Interesting. We're trying to get things done fast, and for me and my sister, fast means high volume. See you around. I get that. Me and my sister Goodbye. are the same. <laughs> Haven't played a game with her in a while. But we did do an escape room recently, and both of us were the loudest people in the room. So goes to show. Ooh, what's can't this? do that. Oh, I can't do that. No, Nancy. Here, distract him. <clears throat> Whoa. Whoa. What the heck? The server room. Oh. This is the, what are these called again? Tartans, the tartans. Loud equals right. <laughs> Computer main. Let's just switch this off. I can't click on anything yet, so... We're gonna need to know this for later. Ooh, what's this? Let's make it really hot. I better watch the 
temperatures. Stop messing with that. Sorry, I'm guessing that alarm means something a little bad a little is happening. Hot in here. <laughs> Servers are getting a bit hot. That alarm triggers when I need to cool them down. If they overheat, everything gets fried. So you have to go back there and reset it every time the alarm goes off? Aye. Interesting. See you around. Mm -hmm. See you around. Maybe that's how we get access Can't do to that. that. Hmm. Hmm. I'll keep that in mind. What? Cool. Spy gear. Spy gear? Are those spy glasses? It's locked. Darn it. Touch to unlock. <laughs> System offline. Fantastic. Oh my god, we're gonna get spy gear. <laughs> ah! Ooh, what's over here? Oh, here we go. Nancy, this is your personal portal into the cathedral archives. We can't release all information, but this should get you through the basics. Alright, Kate Drew, Catherine Austin. Keep in mind, guys, we're gonna have a Nancy Drew trivia in the future. You bet your butt this is gonna be on it. What is Nancy's mom's official name? Catherine Austin Drew. Deceased. Project Colony. Oh, internal name. A Harrier. Challenge code. 0110. CMYK. <laughs> RGB. CMYK. No, is that the same thing? CMYK, cyan, magenta, mm, white, yellow, and K. I don't know what K is. Black, maybe. So we will be setting the alarm off a lot, huh? Oh yeah, you bet your butt. Clack. <laughs> I thought, what is the K? It's black. <laughs> A known associate, Lark. Which is Moira, D D, Double D Cathedral, Condor, Carson Drew, Civilian Spouse, Kestrel, Nancy Drew. Oh my God, Kestrel! That's Nancy's code name. Kestrel, Nancy Drew, civil civilian daughter. Special considerations: Lark is certified and requires no looking after. Harrier requested Condor be allowed restricted clearance, but briefed only as necessary. And Kestrel was granted no clearance and was not to be briefed. Oh, I can zoom in. <laughs> Definitely black. I was just being dumb. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what else? What do we got over here? All right. We can, we can, we can do this. That's this, right? Oh shoot! Fireplace plastic! Is that what this was? P L A S T I C. Oh my god. Got it. Well, that. Now I know how to. What do I do with the fireplace? We gotta go back there. Alright, chat. Find uh, the number pad. Wait, was it a number pad? No, it is a number pad, so not this one. Unless this isn't even it. Uh, oh. No, uh. No, I think this is different. So, no idea what that is. Aww. R. What is this? Carson Drew, civilian. Um, internal name Condor, known associates Kestrel, Osprey, Robin, Swift, Magpie. Um, legal expert formerly involved in the investigation of blank and blank. No longer, <laughs> what the heck, it's blacked out. No longer working in activist cases, maintains a domestic private practice. Interesting, what is this? Non-standard hire practice, Kate Drew. Kate Drew first appeared on the cathedral radar following a series of articles she wrote for the Glasgow Standard. Her ability to cut through high volumes of information quickly became apparent as her career progressed. At this point, she was contacted by her agents. Kate was brought on board after only one step into what is generally a multi-step process when she was a given, 
when she was given a test subject specifically trained by Cathedral to interview. As far as the applicant is concerned, this interview is meant to be meant to test their ability to differentiate between stated facts, stated assumption, and stated disinformation. Before the interview progressed beyond the control portion, Kate had discovered the hidden cameras and microphone and the true purpose of the interview. She was hired on the spot. It is recommended that Kate eventually move into field work, though her primary position with Cathedral will be as an analyst. Kate's ability to see the patterns in large data sets paired with her intuition make her an ideal asset. Her unique interaction style may make her a wild card in the field, but more often than not, her blunt approach will give her direct access to difficult subjects. I love the text. So random, but I like the text <laughs> that was used. Joe, what is all of this? Operative blank is known to this and other intelligence agency trusted but not brief, extremely proficient tactician. What? He has an internal name too, but it's redacted. Oh, here's Moira. McRae. Status, double D. Project Wavebreak Colony. Internal name, Lark. Um, dishonorably discharged? Details of discharge remain sealed. Records pertaining to her whereabouts are not to be requested or distributed. She was dishonorably discharged. Whoa. Hey, look, Nancy. Not, no, extreme skill set crossover with Harrier, which is her mom. Um, auto didact with uncanny interrogation abilities and Harrier's knack for puzzling work and code breaking. Despite experience, Kestrel is not a professional. Do not expect full professional decision making skills. <laughs> not combat ready. Excuse me. Update. American Intel has obtained a parcel addressed to Kestrel. Inspection indicates she may be believed to have access to sensitive information contained within her household. Update. Kyoto Contact with source LM confirms suspicions that Kestrel may be manipulated by those who know her past. LM reports a fixation with a deceased member of the of family S. LM reports Kestrel is driven to solve the case of the mother's death. Her actions are uninvited. The psychology psychology here is clear to anyone looking and is on the whole is on the whole a worrisome development. Update. Further developments nece necessitate investigation. This document will no longer be updated. Hmm. LM? Sec. Moira, double D. <laughs> My new favorite character. Adam! <sighs> He's just honest. Oh, Ned! Oh my god, his internal name is Robin. Like Batman and Robin. That's cute. Known aliases. Nedgar, Nedwin, Nedstifer, Nedley, Nedward, Nedard, him. I want to say an extra one. Ned Milkerson, all right. Um, from <laughs> Core Keeper. <laughs> Kestrel's boyfriend of many years. Robin's loyalty and honesty make him an unlikely target for any individuals attempting to influence Kestrel. Oh, that's sweet. <gasps> George. Her internal name is Swift. Ooh, she's a Swifty. Uh, Magpie's cousin. Oh, I'm guessing Bess. Uh, Magpie's cousin, trusted confidant, shows strong mechanical and engineering abilities and is watch listed by a number of civilian organizations following her innovative work at the Jovic Center for Advanced Mechanical Study. Good job, George. Who's this? Michael Ochism. Internal name Sparrow. Wave break. Killed in field operation spearheaded by Lark, which is... Lark was Moira's codename. Investigations into the failure of wave, wave break 
have been sealed. It is the opinion of the office that Sparrow's death was unavoidable and is not the result of any improper action on the part of Lark. While the case is to be, er, while the case is to remain sealed, it is important to note that Sparrow's mission was well executed and vital to a number of ongoing cathedral missions. Lark acted with bravery and skill, and her involvement in a casualty mission is not to reflect poorly upon her career in any way. She was dishonored, discharged. Bess. Oh, oh my god, Bess. What is this? Colony formula. The formula has been lost following the chaos of the colony event. Harrier was instructed to intercept the final formula if possible. It is not known if this formula was in fact preserved. The colony scientists. A number of scientists were cons conscripted by Revenant. Only two have not been properly debriefed following the event. One has since been found dead of seemingly natural causes, the other vanished without a trace shortly before Harrier's death. All involved scientists were eligible for placement and secure relocation. If the remaining biologist involved in the creation of the formula was placed in relocation, he may be currently a target. Hmm. Hi, Red Mario, I'm good, how are you? Because she was dishonorably discharged. What were you guys thinking? <laughs> Uh, what else? What have I not looked at? Oh, here's Hannah. Civilian Osprey has not been debriefed, considered non active. Alright. Where is Bess? Here. Look at Bess's photo. That doesn't look like Bess. Swift's cousin, trusted confidant, lacks judgment but displays above average intuition, easily manipulated, but her candid nature makes her an unlikely target for any individuals attempting to influence Kestrel. Wow. What is this? Colony operation. The colony operation remains one of the more baffling foiled terrorist attacks in recent times. The details of the attack are so bizarre that many believe Cathedral is sitting on a large cache of information about the failed attack. To our dismay, this is not the case. All colony details have been released to the public and are as follows. High level, a biological attack intended to weaken a city, allowing an outside force to realign the governing power structure without use of the military. The attack was biological in nature and was intended to be non-lethal. The aim of the attack appears to be political in nature, although little is known beyond this point. The social control interpretation of the attack remains a favorite theory of most analogies analysis or analysts um it's believed that the colony operation was a dry run for a larger program revenant is rumored ruin rumor blah, 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 blah. revenant is rumored to be developing popular theory asserts revenant is attempting to perfect a non-military method of regime change okay Mechanism. A specially developed viral element will be released into a dense urban population, resulting in an acute destabilization of the government and authoritative bodies. The attack relies upon a particularly precise formula in order to be effective. The virus must affect at least 40% of the population for a period of not less than two weeks. The onset must be immediate, the symptoms severe, and the casualty count must remain low enough to avoid a backlash within the population. The viral agent must also include an off switch to avoid any further unexpected complications and to assure herd immunity will not develop, rendering the formula useless in other instances. Whoa. <laughs> I can't. So that's what the colony was. We already know much. We already know. It was basically COVID. Sort of. <laughs> if COVID had a motive. Um... Or a, gla a glass govid, if that's what it is. That's what we're calling it. Um, and then there was scientists involved, but they said that one was dead. Um, but the other one vanished. And they don't know where the vanished one went, but he might be a target. <gasps> okay, what else? What is this? 
Kate's last days. Nothing is known about Kate's last days before the car crash. Following her return to Scotland, she quickly went off grid to pursue a set of leads that remain undefined. It is it is believed that she was instrumental instrumental in running the colony operation offline. So, seems like they were still doing it. Did I read everything? This is password locked. Darn it. Did I read everything? I think I did. Read that. Can't get that. Read that. Read that. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. And I have no idea what this is. Jeez, that was a lot of reading. Ooh. Money. All right. Should we mark off, track down the passwords? That's done. Check. All right. Um. there's anything else however maybe we can set the temperature wait was there anything else over here oh just more of those no idea what if we make it really cold better not let you and catch me stop messing with that darn it huh oh he's angry oh okay <laughs> Wait, how am I supposed to you not- and catch me. How do I not make him catch me? Stop messing with that! Am I supposed to hide somewhere? I do not let you and catch me. Can I climb? Stop messing with ah! that! Stop messing with that! Not you Darn it! Me. I'm like stuck in a loop until I figure out where I go. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, Chad. Stop I'm messing with stop. that! I'm, tr I'm trying to stop, sir. I'm trying. I can't. I can't. Where do I go, chat? Better not let you and catch me. I'm trying to find like a way where I can like climb up on the server, but I don't think I can. Stop messing with that. <laughs> Stop messing with that. Darn it. <laughs> maybe we didn't mess with it. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. What do I what do I do? What do I do? Better not let you and catch me. Here. Oh, here we go. Okay, we just needed to turn it down. Okay, all right. Stop messing with it. We're gonna need to figure out. We, we need it. We need to like. Oh, money. We need to figure out how we can hide from him so then we can go and unlock that locker. But I need some kind of ladder or something. Hey. <laughs> Stop messing with it. What exactly was the colony operation? The idea was simple. Manufacture a disaster. In this case, it was the release of a virus designed not to kill, but to incapacitate. Pushing the city into a state of disaster. That's stage one. What's stage two? Can we say that Nancy's ahead of the times? If the Glasgow cell carried out the first stage, Revenant would take over. Okay, what would they do next? They'd send in support, put the city back on its feet. And in the days that follow, seize all positions of authority under the guise of emergency action. Drive the stake in the ground, so to speak. And never give back what was taken. Colony was a bit tongue-in-cheek, operations name-wise. It wasn't about shifting a population, it was about shifting power. It was about obedience. Mm. So why is the colony operation starting again? Still not sure. Here's the theory. Just like the good guys figured out Revenant existed, so did some bad guys. And maybe they thought, what if we follow the old script? Will they show up and play their card? Copycat. Which is pretty cute if you think about it. Almost like a seance to conjure a ghost. Mm. I still don't understand why Revenant would want to carry out an attack like this. They do not care. That does not make sense. They don't. 
They are playing the long game. What long game? I would kill to find out. It seems like Revenant was obsessed with getting the formula correct. Why? The formula is important. Too deadly. Obviously a problem. Revenant will not show up unless you hit the sweet spot. They're interested in using this as a test run, not in racking up civilian casualties. Too easy to fight off, then it's just a cold. You need to knock three quarters of the city under a pile of blankets. Then you're home free. What about children, the elderly, people who are already sick? Ah, uh, you know, I don't want to think about that. Back to the formula. If the operation is running again, there is most likely a lab working on an approximation of the virus. Getting everything in place for when the proper formula is available. Once it is, how long would it take to be unleashed? Depends on a lot of factors, quicker than anyone would like. If anyone can find the original scientist, or the original formula, it's a matter of time. If they find both? They'll have it ready almost instantaneously. I wonder if he gets like flashbacks, like, oh, you sound like Kate. Ah, Louie, thank you for the 100 bits. You're so sweet. How are you doing today? <laughs> How do I get into the glass storage case? The storage locking mechanism is half broken, and I can't get it to open unless it's all the way fixed. If you get it back online, can I give it a try? Knock yourself out. Yeah, spy equipment. Is it true that Revenant only allows others to act for them? Let's hope so. If not, then we're terrible at our jobs. The truth is, we think they're us. Imagine what you could do with these resources if your aim went askew. When your what was askew? <laughs> what does Revenant want? The crazy thing is, what they want makes sense. Do not tell anyone I said that. Not a popular opinion, I'm guessing. That one rarely gets asked to the dance. What they want is to rewrite the rules of the world. What do you mean? Why? Get away Imagine from if you got to rewrite the rules of society. Who gets what? Who leads? Who follows? I bet you'd make a lot of changes. Right. But as the lesson of every sci-fi movie where robots become self-aware states, in our flaws lie our perfections. I'll let you go. See you I then. know, I like how he says can, can I, can I, like cannot. He says it differently. Can I. <laughs> How do I, how do I it's get locked. access? Did he say he was gonna turn it back online? Maybe not yet. All right, um, let's go back to the safe house. G for get out of here, like Madrona said earlier. <laughs> oh, uh-oh, uh-oh, here we go. It's time for a new test. Uh-oh. Put the lines on the trash compactor at the station. And you will be rewarded. Cut the lines of the trap. Oh, the trash. What do you do? Huh. How what? I don't really know. I guess I'm something of a detective. Freelance. That's the coolest! Do you have a gun? No, I don't. A badge? Nope. A trilby? Sorry. What's a trilby? Hmm. You should at least have a proper trench and trilby if you're going to be in the detective game. How did you end up becoming a oh, detective? A trilby, I guess a I just have trouble glass? leaving questions unanswered. Unless you're oh, talking fedora. to me. Touche. Oh, Thank you very much. Have you ever heard of Revenant? Are you spy or something? No, just something I overheard. Oh yeah. I guess a spy wouldn't just ask a stranger that. Well, not a good spy. Revenant's supposed to be this terrorist organization. But they tapped out ten years ago. Now it's just the psychos that talk about him. Keeps their psychotic minds busy, which is either very good or very bad. <laughs> that disguise voice, disguise voice is so demonic sounding. It's really Goodbye. creepy. And See like even the call before it calls you, it's like creepy. Creepy too. Okay, so we need to go to the train station. We need to pass our second test. Oh, well, let's talk to him Thank first. you for finding my suitcase. I hope you don't mind. I took a peek inside to confirm it was yours. I gotta say, if you're so attached to your mom's jeans, why did you take them on an international flight? Those are mine. 
Oh. Yeah. Right. You look nice today, Mom, he said with a style. hopeful smile. Let's just move on. There was a poem in my suitcase. It's missing. What are you talking about? There was nothing like that in there? Not that I saw. Likely story. Roasting me about my mom jeans. See you around. There's nothing See wrong you around. with mom jeans. They're more snug and comfortable. The heck? But I feel like we're always in that pattern of like going from mom jean to like mid rise back to low rise to mid rise to mom jean. Like I feel like it's it's come it's like a circle, fashion circle. Anyways. Can I take can I take there's a there's a ladder in here, I'm pretty sure. I can I take that? No. Okay, we have to cut huh. the wires. Here. Done. Done. I guess now I just That's easy. wait. I thought there Ma'am, we're vandal vandalism. Vandalism. Nancy's a criminal. Oh. Wait, how did they <laughs> message to be fair we don't know if the people calling is revenant so kate has sworn she'll never or cat has sworn she, kate cat has sworn she'll never depart from mom jeans after this current fact no same no same i can, why would you want your butt crack to just pop out when you needed to bend and get something not me same with mid-rise. Mid-rise still is iffy. Depends. Mom jeans would just pack everything in. And, uh, they're comfortable. So. Don't know what else to think about that. Also, I was told by TikTok that, um, what we call the fupa is, um, now called the... Uh, some scientific name that Gen Z is taught calling it the Im immor Im immortal Im something, immortal something, <laughs> and that it is uh, um, liked or something. Where we tried to hide ours, they're like showing it off. Of where is it? In, in primordial pouch. Thank you. That is what they're calling it. And I was like, interesting. Primordial pouch like a cat? Yes. And it's like, looked up on. Or uh, look, it's not frowned upon. <laughs> and I was like, awesome. I fit in. <laughs> I swear fashion goes, okay, we've been comfortable long enough. This year it's butt crack time. And that lasts until we are all dying from hip. <laughs> like, sure. Ah, it's true. Okay, where? Oh, what's this? Temporary clothes for repairs. Oh no, it's because we were banned. We are ba American vandalism. Where is the safe house? Was it in Loch Lomond? I think so. Yes, this is it. All right, plastic. Okay, chat. Plastic. So three down. One, two, three, four, five down. Can y'all write those down for me? Three, five. P L A two down. Oh wait, I'm gonna have to do like left or right. Okay, maybe we do this one at a time. One, two, plastic. Okay.
need to figure out the password. Plastic! A lot of passwords. I have no idea. Oh, <gasps> CMYK. No, there's like... That's done. Can't still have to check. Can't check that off. St check. I got a message to come find out what really happened to my mom. I thought your mom was in a bad accident when she was visiting a friend. Well, that's what I thought too, but... Turns out it was a murder. But something weird happened before she left. My mom and dad got into this fight. It was like nothing I'd seen before, but I didn't know what to do about it. You were just a kid, Nancy. I wasn't just a kid, I was her daughter, and I should have done whatever it took to get her to stay. Nancy, maybe your dad is right. Maybe this is too dangerous. It might be best to just come home. Ned, there's a reason I called you and not someone else. It's not the charm? <laughs> it's never the charm. That's the backhand. Standing by for the compliment. Sorry, that's not how I meant to put it, Ned. I know you can make the promise I need you to make. Promise to help me, even if that means pushing me towards something dangerous. Do you understand what I mean? I do. Good. Oh, thank you. From here on out, no holding anything back. No protecting me from myself. I could agree to that. I knew you could, and I'm sorry to ask that of you. All I ask is you do whatever it takes to make it home in one piece. Have I ever missed a date? Yes, all of the time. Oh my God. Have I ever missed anything that was really important to you? No. Then it's a deal. <laughs> Have I missed a date all the time? Is this the first time we see his handsome Ned face? No, we've seen his face multiple times. And like pictures and stuff. I need to know everything you can find about Revenant. Um, what? 
I don't know. It's a terrorist organization. At least I think it is. Do you still have access to the database at the paper? Yeah, but there are still clearance issues. Wouldn't most of this stuff be classified? Can't let a little thing like that slow us down. And Ned? Yeah? I'm running in the dark here. Give me everything. Gossip, rumors. Really? Really. Sometimes with organizations like this, a lot of details hide in plain sight. Got it. I don't know who else to ask. I'm getting calls from an anonymous caller. It might be Revenant. What are they saying? They want me to help them. Don't. Ned, don't forget what you promised. Okay, okay, okay. Help them do what? <laughs> Little things. I think they're trying to figure me out. So you don't think they're asking you to do anything that would hurt anyone? If they do, obviously I'll stop. But they're promising me information about my mom, about what she was doing up until the point of the accident. Do you really want to know about that? Yes, I really do. Then I guess I don't know what to tell you. If you're not doing anything bad and you need to know... I do. Then I guess you could be the judge of what's best. But maybe you don't need to know. That's not how I work. I know. But maybe everything you need to know about your mom, maybe you already know all of that. Yeah, maybe. I need you to get the original copy of the Jabberwocky poem. Original meaning? The color version my mom had. I need you to scan it and send it here. Shouldn't you ask your dad? He'll say no. So? Ned, I need you to break into my house and oh. get that poem. Break Don't in. Beth and George have keys? They do, but they're out of town. We're asking our right. boyfriend. I'm sorry, to Ned. break in our house. No need to apologize. You've certainly made my life weirder, but you've also made it much better. If all you ask in return is a little burglary now and again, it's a fair trade. <laughs> Technically, it doesn't count because you have permission. I don't think the Nancy said it's cool approach will be all that effective in a court of law. <laughs> hey, if your dad catches me, do you think he'll still be my lawyer? <laughs> uh, that was sweet. What does it net? Yeah, why doesn't he have a key? That is weird. Bess and George has a key, but he doesn't. Maybe, maybe Nancy's dad doesn't want it because he's a guy. Yeah, maybe that's why. Moira was kidnapped. Whoa. By who? I have no idea. Be careful out there, okay? Oh, we should probably go visit her now. She's not kidnapped anymore. <laughs> the cabin is some sort of weird high-tech something or other. Not gonna lie, that is awesome. But why? Working on it. I met my cathedral contact. What exactly is cathedral? It's a local intelligence agency. Like the... Actually, I don't know how to finish that. Like a field office of the FBI. They're watching over Glasgow. So what's this contact like? Can't tell. He's not really giving much away. Professional habit, I imagine. True. So do you think you can trust him? No, but that's the standard answer these days. You can always trust a Ned. That's exactly what an imposter would say. Busted. That's cute. Gotta give one to George, Beth, Sally, Sabrina, Rachel, and Nicole first. <laughs> I'm cooperating with the calls from Revenant. So you can learn more about what happened to your mom, right? Yeah. Do you think that's a smart thing to do? I don't know. Me either. We sabotaged the trash compactor. I don't think it's a good idea, Nancy. I'll let you go. Thanks. Bye. All right. Well, he's going to help us with the poem. Shall we call the dad? He's going to be so angry. You've reached the personal oh, line of Carson answer. Drew. Please direct all business matters to the firm switchboard. Kind of worse, in my opinion. All right. Well, we got to figure out this thing, but I have no idea how. Um, we also got a need, we need to play the bagpipes. Don't know the password for that plastic. I don't know what this is either. What is that? Is that like pulling a cable? I don't know what that is. And I can't click these two options. It's like a fly with a little antenna. And we can't click over here. All right, let's go. Oh. Oh, yeah, we can't click that either. All right, let's go to Moira. She was in uh, Gifnock. 
I need to have a ticket. Darn it, I need to have a ticket. Darn tickets. Well, I'm gonna buy the most expensive one. So then maybe I don't have to do this for a while. All right, gift knock. All right, I think she's not, oh wait, this isn't it. Oops, this is something else. Well, is there any, <coughs> is there anything else here? Ah, how nice. Okay, wrong place though. Um, I guess Beardson is where Moira is. <laughs> What a nice song! Oh, there she is! Hi. Hi. What's the story with the cabin you sent me to? The cabin is one of many. Cathedral had it fitted with tech for Kate and me once Colony started to heat up. No one but Kate and I knew of the location. Do not give that information out to anyone. <laughs> you can trust me. How was my mom involved with the Colony Article operation? Ned. Your mom stopped it. How? Not much is known, really. The operation needed three things. Someone to develop the biological agent, someone to make it in quantity, and someone to distribute it in a way that would affect the entire city. Your mum broke that chain. I don't know how. What happened when you were gone? I don't want to talk about it. Why not? Maybe it's personal. Did you ever stop to think about that? Do you have anything that will help me understand what my mom was doing here and why she was involved in tracking such a dangerous group? At first it was a police matter, but your mother was studying them for cathedral. She had a crazy theory. Which was... Here. Ooh. Okay. I don't really understand what this all means. Someone was using Glasgow as their laboratory. Each experiment was getting bigger, scarier. When we were done with our research, we were staring Revenant dead in the eye. We didn't know it until we were dragged into the central office for an emergency briefing, of course. But we did know we were looking oh. at something terrifying. Oh, that skips it. That makes her talk faster. Oh, I My like mom that. had a song she always played. Do you know anything about it? She loved that song. It may just be sentimental, but I don't know. Doubt it. What song? What's the story with your record player? Go on, take a look. I'm a novice turned tablist. <laughs> you, DJ? Once in a while. Mainly just party nights at the pub down the way. But I've been branching out into deep house lately. Really? Oh, that's surprising. Ugh. I know you think you're going to stay the same age forever, but you won't. There, is this better? Oh, that belongs to the sweet young man who brings my meals. He's such a dear. Even helping me dig my own grave in the back garden. <laughs> All right, I get it. <laughs> Have a seat, dearie. I'll tell you about how things used to cost less. And then I'll say something racist, and you won't even know what to do about it because I'm old, and it just seems like a lost cause at this point. Enough. I'm sorry. It's a completely expected hobby. so true though but what I was not expecting a family friendly game to bring it up the heck it's so sassy I know I love it but whoa too real why are people after you right now the colony operation is restarted and they're looking to pick up where they left off Nancy your mother's death wasn't an accident I know. That's what the message that led me here said. I know it wasn't an accident. Your father knows it wasn't an accident. The only other people who know are the people who killed her. That's who sent you the message. This whole theme is the coolest theme, I feel, for... I want to say the majority... Uh, mm, it's up there. It's up there in ranking with the theme and, like the story behind this game. Like, this is pretty cool. I like it. Why was I brought to Glasgow? Different. 
They think you might be the key to the secrets Kate left behind. I'm not. You could be. Kate would never give you information that would put you in danger. But the more you love someone, the more you show your secrets, whether you mean to or not. That's why the family of a spy is never safe, as your father was fond of pointing out. Hmm. Who is the silent spy? Huh? Name drop. The message I got Time mentioned drop. a silent spy. Ah, it's Gallo's humor. It's a take on an old book. Meaning? The only silent spy is a dead spy. Oh. How did you and my mom know each other? We were both in the same J school program. She was a better journalist than I was, and I hated her for it. A fact I made plainly clear. After graduation, I was happy I'd never have to see that smug face of hers ever again. Until, of course, in true Kate style, she called out of the blue to say she'd set me up with a job at the paper she'd been working at. I don't know if she mistook my hatred for healthy competition, or what it was all about. Your mother had this infuriating habit of expecting the best out of people. Aww. She confused me into being nice to her. I dare say I miss her almost as much as you must. What? That's... that's nice. Writers have gone full on unhinged with this one. They really have though. <laughs> but I like it. My father told me not to trust you. Something's not when adding this, up here. Come out? I'm year? not sorry that I lied. I'm sorry that I have to tell you the truth. Yeah, I can see that. Your mother came back to Scotland because I begged her to. She told me for months that Cathedral was like her family, but you and Carson were her family. She had a responsibility to you. She had made a promise to your father, and she meant it. But I begged. I told her I believed she was the only one who could help me stop the attack. That wasn't the lie. What was? I promised her she'd have round-the-clock MI5 protection from wheels down to meeting you at baggage claim back home. She trusted me. There was no one watching wow. who was there. No. As surely as she saved untold lives, I took hers with that lie. I took wow. her from you with that lie. Please forgive me. Better yet, don't forgive me. Get angry and leave and go home. Dang, so she's the reason... She's the reason why Nancy's mom died. Hello. Dang. 2013. Oh, thanks, Supreme! I did, I showed a, a, I took a photo and I put it on Twitter. For those that want to see the, I finished the uh, Deku Tree Lego set, um, this morning. She's the reason for the season. So you are a spy, and my mother, was she? She was. Why didn't you tell me earlier? I made a promise to Kate that if anything happened to her, you would never ever be dragged into this mess. <laughs> Look at me what now. made you change your mind? You dragged yourself in. From here on out, it's survival. Oh my goodness, there's so much more to say. How did you become friends with my mom? We worked together at the Standard. She did features, I did news. She was a good friend. So the two of you worked together back when you were a reporter? Still am. Well, a blogger, so hard to say. Everyone keeps telling me to leave. I can't do that. You still don't get it. This isn't dangerous to just you. You just made your entire life a target. Your father, your friends, anyone who knows you. Does that include you? Oh, don't factor me in. I bought my ticket years back. Do you know anything about my cathedral contact, Ewan? Not a thing. I lost the keys to cathedral long ago. In my experience, cathedral means well, but don't trust recklessly. Did my mom live out here after I was born? Not quite. She'd come out here for months at a time with you and your father. Back then, we were still writing together. You weren't in school yet, so you were good to go anywhere. And Carson used to like it here. Those were good times. Aww. See you around. All right then. Okay. Well, that told me some stuff, but honestly not a lot to go with. <laughs> Open the lockbox and Moira safe. Can't check that off yet. The locked box. Oh yeah. But I don't know how. So still need to do that. Track down a color copy. I'm hoping Ned. 
can give us that now. Maybe we can call him. He can say he's going to send it over or something. Hi, Nancy. So, how... Am I on speakerphone? Yeah. Yes, Nancy, you are on the speakerphone. Oh, oh. no! Mm-hmm. I would like to remind... Shut up, Ned. Don't talk to Ned that way. Actually, at this, uh, juncture, that might be warranted. Thank you, Ned. You're welcome. Shut up, Ned! Nancy, do you want to take a guess at why I'm upset with Ned right now? He broke into the house. Well, can't say that doesn't factor in. I'm upset with Ned because he let you talk him into something dangerous, and he wasn't smart enough to stop you. Whoa, hold on. All due respect, Mr. Drew, you're wrong. All due respect, Mr. Nickerson, you're a complete... Let me finish. I know Ooh. how serious this is, but I also know Nancy. Better than her own father, I assume? As well as... What? But I can admit something you wow. can't. And just what exactly is that? Nothing I say is going to stop Nancy, not this time. I understand why you don't want to help her, but that'll make things more dangerous for Nancy. She called me because she knows that my faith in her is stronger than my fear for her. So now you can tell me to shut up. The poem is on the top shelf of the bedroom closet. Can you go get it and give me a moment with Nancy? Sure thing, Mr. Drew. Sorry I burgled your house. Wow. Nancy, I don't know what to do here, kiddo. I wish you would just come home. But I think Ned is right, and you were right to go to him. Thanks. I'll talk to you again soon. Wow. Shut up, Ned. <laughs> Hi, Aki. Dang. Okay. So we, we still need that. to get the copy. Um, track down the passwords for the lock entries in the archives. Discover what's hidden within the vault. Yes, trying that. You would think that she would tell me more. Hello. Talk to you later. Seems like I can't Bye. talk to her anymore. Gosh, day. My dad told my boyfriend to shut up. I'm gonna tell mom. Oh wait. Oh. Flashback. Are you really going to go? Have a seat. No, Dad told me you're leaving. Why? Nancy, it's not like that. Are you coming back? I know, you heard some stuff between me and your dad, but you've got the wrong idea, kiddo. Then what's the right idea? You'll understand when you're older. Why is that always all you say? Trust me, if I could tell you everything, I would. But for now, I just can't. Now, come and sit. Let's practice. I'm sorry. I just can't. Wow. Can you imagine having a big white grand piano? Just playing it. Um, uh, dead thing! More flashbacks. There's, I don't need anything here, right? I don't think, no, not yet. Just eventually. That piano is also what I retained from that. <laughs> the piano was huge. Want to hear a funny story? Sure. Great, give me your phone. Um, come on, give phone, give me the phone. Come on, you know you're curious as to why I want it. I am, but curiosity uh, killed the cat. That's not exactly helping your case. Oh, give me, please. I won't do anything crazy. All right. Yay! My boyfriend just tried to break up with me with a voicemail, if you can believe that. Why did so, she turn around? <clears throat> dropped my phone into a sewer. This isn't my phone. Don't write back. Loophole! I was going to dump him soon anyway, but in person, like you do. Thanks for your... Whoa! I need that back. Are you in trouble? I don't know. Can I listen to the rest? It might be safer for you if you didn't. You are a spy! I mean, shh, no you're not. But you are! Oh my god, this girl is so nosy and stalkery. The heck, man? Hi, Albert. Talk to you later. See you later. You have four cats? Wow. What kind of cats are they? Wait, I can click on this? What the heck? That was weird. 
All right, um, well, let's go to, oh, there we go. This is where I wanna go talk to him. Found out the deal with that Alec fella. Yeah, anything interesting? No, he's harmless. Harmless? I think so. But if he's taking a shine to you, use it to your advantage. She's such a stalker. She's dressed like you. <laughs> it's true. It's like a whole nother like dimension <laughs> of stalking. I'm playing Nancy. She's stalking Nancy. I'm Nancy. Yeah. Aggie, do you? Is Moira really former cathedral? That's true. And she's retired? Retired, fired. Guess one's easier to say than the other. See you around. They won't tell me why she got fired. Let me I in here. I can't do that right now. Still haven't been able to figure out how to get access to that. It's I locked. Don't know how to fix this. Apparently you need to turn the system back online. I read these. Still don't know have the password for this. Maybe it's password. And then I want to distract him, but I can't figure out how to like get, like hide in here. It's gotta be some, there's a vent right there. Oh no. Here, let's choose one. Oh wait, actually we can call, let's call Ned. Maybe he has the copy now. Is everything okay over there? Did you find anything about Revenant? Oh boy, where to start? Start at the point that makes the most sense. Right, uh, hmm. Uh, Ned? Look, I have to admit, I'm out of my depth here. <laughs> Welcome to the club. That's the thing. I don't know if I'd call Revenant a terrorist organization. They're like a club or a secret society. Am I evaluating all things equally? Rumors and reports, all that good stuff? Yeah. I threw out all things that contained false flag, chemtrail, vaccines, and Anunnaki. Good methodology. Anunnaki? What I end Where up with is that? neutral. Neutral? Isn't that from the yeah, tube some one? say they're behind all sorts of terrible things. And Aliens. others? That's what it was. Other people say they're almost like a humanitarian group. Well, a highly creepy and somewhat illegal humanitarian group. That makes almost no sense. You know what words crop up more than anything else in all the chatter? Confusing? Parent. Guardian. That sort of thing. That may be how they see themselves, at least that's how they're acting. Okay. You mentioned the word parent came up a lot when talking about Revenant. What do you think that means? According to some blogger, it's because sometimes they're helpful, sometimes they seem Blogger. Cool. But there's a design behind everything. And if they're a good parent, then it's almost like they're trying to shape the world into what they think it should be. And if they're not a good parent? Then they're trying to shape the world in their own image. I'll let you go. Bye. Hmm. So they call themselves a parent. Ha can't, can't, Still haven't done that. Can't do anything. But that's okay, because it's four o'clock. We'll stop here. <laughs> Figure out what to, to do. Here we go. <laughs> I don't know what that's probably gonna be me using hints or something. Maybe I need to call her dad. We'll play we'll play more tomorrow though. But this is fun! This is a good this is a good game. They did good. They did really good with this one. I'm impressed.